What is going on guys, my name is Ron back in from Roman Reviews here with another episode reaction to ReZero Season 3, Episode 55, A Dark Turrent. Torrent, sorry, not Turrent. Uh, apparently, something happened, I was, I saw a post on my Discord about how there's going to be some confusion on this episode. There's going to be some confusion on the last episode, so apparently uh, anime has this tendency, the anime has a tendency to omit some information. We got some information omitted about Al, apparently, uh, and I've read about Pound that. I haven't read much about this besides the fact that more than likely this episode is going to be very confusing for us anime-only watchers. So, yeah. Um, really quickly, I do want to apologize for not uploading anything for Dan to Dan. I have not even touched fourth episode. I've been so swamped and so tired lately i actually didn't even really have a lot of energy uh to really just do reactions i've been really just doing my own normal things and i've had less energy just to do other stuff in general uh it is now cooling down in the weather i'm wearing a long sleeve shirt uh normally i would have a jacket on but thankfully we're keeping it pretty warm inside as well but Still cold enough, I need a long sleeve shirt. I know, I know, I know you guys don't even care about that, but yeah. Uh, I'm ready to jump into this episode. I'm ready to be confused, and I will be pointing things out. Um, and if you guys have anything you guys want to comment, I read all the comments, of course. Uh, but if there's anything you want to comment and build upon without really spoiling anything, if it's going to be talked about later, uh, yeah, then definitely leave it down below, and I will appreciate everyone who comments. But yeah, I'm ready to jump into this episode reaction, so, let's, so, eh, so let us jump into episode 55 of ReZero Zone in 3, 2, 1, let's jam. And she's naked. Yeah, knowing her. That's right. Fuck boy. Seventy-nine. Is this going to be one of his wives too? Probably. One eighty-four. Are they literally just going to be called numbers? Little King? Ugh. We've seen the intro. I, I kind of just want to jump... Oh, shit. I kind of just want to jump right into the meat of things. Alright. This bastard.
little girl Easter. He's like, he's got to see the bigger picture. <laughs> oh, oh, it's the girl. Of course. Yeah, but she can heal extremely fast, so... Yeah. I feel like the... Her face being like blown apart healed much faster than those cuts. Is it going to be a giant bloodbath or something? Yeah, that's. Oh, no! It's little bugs. They're flies. Did he turn them into flies? Ugh. That would be disturbing. I don't like flies. It's like giant bloat flies from Fallout. Ah. Uh... Was that a hostage? And he that's why it struck. Oh, thank you for not shying away from the gore. Maybe age like your body like 10, 15 years, 20. Oh, God. Okay, like, Subaru's getting fucked up this timeline. Well, partially transformed. Yeah. That's fucking disturbing. That's pretty good, though. They're people. So they find it in a certain way. Hold on.
Phenomenal voice acting. Not incorrect. Oh, hey, at least she's not pulling the rent, but maybe because she hasn't seen her, maybe. It's great hearing. Um, oh, man, I'm totally drawing a blank on her real voice actress name. But hear this. Oh god, that face with Amelia is just so fucking... Oh my god. Okay, yeah, okay, at this... Is he gonna heal her? Oh, God. Well, okay, so he actually, he's going to reset after this. No. No way. Is he not going to reset and then Cruz is actually going to be turned into some amalgamation? It, it's his wife. I'm, like, flabbergasted. Oh. They are nail. I mean, it's re zero. It's Re Zero, so they always have phenomenal voice acting, but Jesus, take the wheel. Oh. 
No, that hurt too. Oh, it was because of the same. Yeah. yeah. I have no idea where this is going to go. Bro, there's so this is information overload. Funny thing is, I feel like this guy could just easily just what? A but it's also his father, so understandable. Like a little cockroach thing. Jesus Christ. <laughs> that works too. Oh, I was like, that's Otto's voice. He can speak to, he can speak to animals. No? Yeah, it's split up. I I feel like this is definitely a season I'd really need to rewatch from the beginning to the end with no breaks because a week to week basis while it is great for theory crafting it is very hard to focus and pay attention to everything well with my current mindset it's a little bit hard Oh. Aren't those the same the part of the trio of the robbers? I could be wrong. I haven't seen them since first season. Oh, it's the water. Did they release the dam? Yeah. They opened the dam in a sense. That would cause so much damage. Okay, how are they just standing there?
And who's this person that's like, who's this person? No, fuck you, fuck you. That was not 20 minutes. That wasn't 20 minutes. Artificial spirit. Is it the singer? No. All right, we're going to say it outside of the fact that this was just a pure amount of information and things happening all at once this was the episode i feel like out of all the other episodes this was the episode where just shit was happening okay so i'm assuming subaru loses his leg it's way too far in the loop to reset now this was shown two episodes ago but every time i'm like how the hell are they not resetting we got to see Krush with some this deep this dragon blood mixture that's on her that caused others to turn we still saw that her body was still the same and then some of it was put on subaru's leg is subaru gonna have like this weird leg or is the fact that they escaped nullifying the blood i don't know but what's gonna happen i have not a damn clue and i like it that way but yeah, as I was saying throughout the episode, I feel like this is the season you can't watch on a week-to-week -week basis if you're trying to really focus on everything. Now, I am an anime only. There is information that is going to be omitted because of the transformation from light novel to animation form. You're going to lose some one way or another. I do feel like some things were are going to be cut out, but everything, it didn't feel like anything was, like, a mysterious. It was just more of, I want to know what's happening later on. Nothing like, this came out of nowhere. I got that more on the last episodes. Or last episode. But, again, another banger of an episode. It's just, I think the worst thing about the show is the fact that I had to wait next week. It's the most, I know it's cliche, but in, in reality, as someone who loves lore, and figuring things out, this is horrible to watch. But it's also very fun. Like, the fact that I don't have my old roommate in here to bounce off ideas. Oh, man. I mean, he's already read significantly. He already knows that happens in this because he read it. He was that invested in it. And I'm like, I can't. Yeah. it was. This is a good... This is such a good show. But yeah. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys saw in the comment section below. Go Knights, go! They're playing the knight, the kings. Uh, who shall win? The knight or the king? It's gonna be a good match. But yeah, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. Whatever was omitted, uh, let me know as long as it doesn't spoil anything down further the line. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys maybe tomorrow. I'm, I'm still trying to figure it out, because if I do tomorrow, I need to catch up on episode 4 of Dan to Dan. And I do apologize for that. It just a lot lately and now that the holiday season's ramping up it's 
going to be even busier. But we'll see what happens. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys next time. See ya.